kwamba mheshimiwa eh, Siloya kutoka pale Sabatia pia naye ametumana salamu zake na ako na kibeti chake ili tuweze kuendeleza kazi ya kanisa hawa wote ni wale watu wamesimama na sisi hata kama hawako siku ya leo katikati yetu kama kanisa i just want to say three things uh, uh, governor isaac ni kama ulisoma mdomo yangu na roho yangu kasema so yale governor isaac amesema ikiwa imefanyika lazima ilipangwa ikiwa ilipangwa tukubali ili yaishe kwa hivyo kama kanisa tunasema tunaomba ili watubu alafu wakue waupe si ndio so as leadership we need also to take responsibility because if we don't take responsibility who else will if we don't ask ourselves the hard questions as leaders who will do that because all that we need to do is to take responsibility talk to our supporters and tell them that this is the direction that we are supposed to go tukimalizana na hiyo kama viongozi tukichukua jukumu haya mengine tunasema tutakuwa tukisema kwa njia ya ukweli hapa tumekuwa kwa kanisa hapa si tuna starehe si tunafurahia tumesikiza neno tumewapa wana, wa, wanaoongea viongozi nafasi waongee kwa nini hatujapata kilele kwa sababu haijapangwa si ni ukweli kwa hivyo as leadership of Bomet County we must speak the truth and we speak from the heart si ile kudanganyana hapa iti kwa sababu tunaongea tuongee hivyo tu and that is the conversation that we must pick it up and deal with it that is the first message i wanted to share today nikiwa hapa kwa kanisani jambo la pili hawa viongozi wengine hapa wameongea hiyo excellency kuzu mambo ya fasalaisa jana nimetembea hapa for the last 10 years hii bomet yetu punda wale tumekuwa tukiwaona ni punda wa kubeba sand hapa kuna sand harvesting place hapa juu for the last 10 years we have not harvested this was the year we were harvesting because of that fertilizer na jana nimetembea nikaona mapunda karibu kumi nikasimama nikauliza hii ni sand ama ni mahindi nikaambiwa ni mahindi that tells you there was something good with the fertilizer and the decision that you have done is to make sure that we make it happen for the benefit of the farmer na pia sisi kama viongozi mahala popote pale tuko if we know those cartels let us deal with them because if we don't do it again we can't leave everything to his excellency and the leadership above let's also manage from our level all the way from ule mtu kutoka pale chini mpaka huku juu ya tatu na ya mwisho hii bomet yetu ni peaceful so tukaribishe wageni wote kutoka hule wa hapa nyumbani na hule wa kutoka kule kwingine. Nataka kushukuru eh, viongozi wengine ambao wako hapa. Nimeambiwa ni wa kuna viongozi wengine wa kanisa. Kuna former eh, mheshimiwa Bomet East mheshimiwa Bet ambaye yuko pale, pia ni director pale Kemsa. Asante sana mheshimiwa. Eh, nimeambiwa pia kuna wengine. Kuna CEO rafiki yangu eh, 